Okay. Let's roll before the rain comes back. <laughs> Don't swear on YouTube though. I can't swear. If you can swear, I have to cut it out or bleep it. That's good um, you know, filmmaking. Yeah. Intro? Um, Anything that you mm -hmm. want me to say? Do you want me to shout out your Instagram? Do you want people to follow you? I mean, if they like cat pictures, sure. Cat There's pictures. nothing else. People I, love cat pictures. <laughs> yeah. How's your brother? When he's, when's he going to drive? He is 10. He's so 10. He's got ages. Like eight years, yeah. Seven <laughs> yeah. years. Yeah. Are you going to teach him? You'll be I guess, yeah, three I could. years. Yeah, you could teach I would him. be able to. Then your dad will have two pub picker uppers. Your dad probably doesn't even drink after I've said that so many times. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, he'll oh, watch the video oh, and you're like, do. Oh, they do. Oh, they do. Okay, cool. Both my parents. So, they like yeah. a drink. But, uh, that makes them sound yeah. always pissed. <laughs> <laughs> what is up, guys? I'm here with Jess, and Jess has got a driving test, um, and you've done four lessons. Yeah. And so you were like, hey, Francis, I've got a driving test ages away, and I've done a couple of driving lessons, so yeah. can I have a mock test? And I was like, no. <laughs> and then what did you say? Yeah, I have driven pretty much every day every with day. my parents. Your parents, so, who are definitely yeah. not alcoholics. No! <laughs> Cut that out. Is your dad going to watch this? <laughs> yes, definitely. He's going to watch it, okay. <laughs> no, 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 no. Not um, Cool, so you've done loads of driving with your dad. Let's see how much of a good teacher your dad is. Obviously, your instructor hasn't done a lot of teaching with you because four lessons isn't a lot. Most people use yeah. 40 hours or 22 hour lessons to get up to a standard where they're near a driving mm -hmm. test. You've done way under that, so this is going to be interesting. Yeah. Do you think you're going to pass today? I think I can. Um, yeah, kind of just, we'll see. I kind of want to check if I've picked up any bad habits From and things. Dad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Is your dad a fast driver or a good driver? My dad's quite a fast driver and my mum says she's gotten slower after teaching okay. me. Great. So we're going to take a little drive around with Jess. Normal driving test style. You haven't done a driving test before. So mm -hmm. at the beginning of your driving test, the examiner will say your test will last 38 to 40 minutes. We're going to complete one manoeuvre and potentially an emergency stop. We're going to do 20 minutes of independent driving, either following a sat nav or following road signs. Today we've got the sat nav set up. Mm -hmm. And when I'm directing you, all I want you to do is follow the road ahead, obey all roads signs and when I'm directing you um, I will no, obey follow the road ahead obey all of the road signs and if I want you to turn left or right I'll let you know mm -hmm. obviously I'm gonna cut that bit cool. together so I look wrong yeah <laughs> how do you switch your headlights from dip beam to main beam and how do you know main beam is switched on that's the question so turn on the dipped headlights using the switch and then uh, turn them on to main beam using this yeah thing. what do you do push it or pull it um, or up or down Pull it, I think. Is it push it? Push it, yeah, you push oh, okay. it. And then you can, there should be a light that comes up when it's on main beam. Yeah, what color is the light? Uh, green? No, no, it's not. I, mean, I don't know. Try it. Okay. Oh, it's blue. <laughs> when you're ready, drive on. home with you so you can reflect on all of the mistakes cool. that you're gonna make. Yeah. Might need a spare pick. <laughs> Joking! Turn left, then turn right.
any of that audio that is actually how confusing a tom tom sat nav is jess got pretty lucky there she was only planning one junction at a time and found herself in the wrong lane to turn right she managed to get into the right lane with no hassle but if you find yourself in that position remember you can go the wrong way on your test with no penalty turn left a really slick and fast turn but a few of Jess's junctions have felt a bit rushed. You're only one mistake away from failing your driving test so try and be careful around hazards. Give yourself a bit more time without being too slow. You might want to start slowing a bit earlier or get the correct gear a bit sooner so as you're turning you only have to concentrate on steering. This is the Berrylands area of Tolworth. It's 20 miles an hour, pretty narrow, and the priority on the road switches as the cars are parked on different sides. If the hazard you need to drive around is on your side, then you should be giving way to oncoming traffic. Oh, I can't message you because you don't follow me. What? Oh yeah, and then that's I followed I followed driving school. I don't uh, driving school TV, but I don't think I followed you. Rude. <laughs> Take that person. Uh, okay, Jess. Yes, when it's safe to do so, can you show me how you demist the front windscreen? Great. Thanks. yards turn right perhaps that van ahead was a little bit ambitious yeah. because I've been ambitious here before okay. <laughs> width restrictors are very narrow don't be a hero your examiner will appreciate you taking it in first gear at walking speed rather than trying to show off and take it at warp speed uh, you need a driving test like next week <laughs> so I wish! Yeah, it's hard to find oh, one. Um, yeah. Turn right. Thanks, drive on when you're ready. Sure. 
Jess did a good left blind spot check, but she missed the right blind spot. That's her first driver fault. Okay, thanks. Now I'd like you to reverse back to car spaces. It is really important to check both blind spots when you're reversing. If a pedestrian is close enough to be in your mirror, they're about to be behind your car. That's too late to spot them. When you look out of the window, you can see them way before they even get near you. Yeah, that's all right. Thanks, drive on when you're ready. Jess did the whole maneuver without looking over her right shoulder once. So unfortunately, that's going to be a fail. So, like normal, the examiners don't talk to you on a driving test, they just let you concentrate. Because you're taking your driving test and you want the proper experience, I'm going to do that too. Yeah. Yeah, if you get a chatty examiner, they won't talk to you very much. It will usually be just at traffic lights or yeah. when you're stationary. Because they can't wait to talk about football. Some <laughs> examiners get like, oh, I just need to talk to somebody. If I was an examiner, can you imagine me as an examiner? Oh my God. <laughs> People be failing left, right and centre. Can this guy just shut up? Sharp right, then bare left. Turning right on a big traffic light controlled crossroads like this one is tricky. I'm impressed with how Jess handles this so calmly. She positions well in the middle without blocking any oncoming traffic and sets off smoothly as soon as there's a gap. So you thought we'd be done by now, didn't you? <laughs> I just want to get back to tutoring these bloody kids. <laughs> Oh, by the no. way, Jess is a maths tutor. If you need maths help, <laughs> if you're like seven times tables, <laughs> yeah. If you need some times table practice help, Jess has got your back. Driving lessons, maths practice. <laughs> Bear left, then at the end of the road, turn left. pull up on the left in a safe place. Cool, drive on when you're ready. Okay, well there was an episode of Catfish where this guy had a, an account for his cat and he had like 300,000 oh, yeah. subscribers. Yeah. yeah, people are super into this. Yeah. Yeah, is yeah. your cat cute? Or yeah, he's, he's the most cute cat in that. the entire world. If you have a cat or a baby, you've got to say they're cute, <laughs> otherwise like social services. Okay. Turn left. We are turning left towards Surbiton, which is another pretty difficult area in Tolworth. It's busy, there are difficult junctions, and the high street looks like it's from a hazard perception video. Oh my god, like we did at Surbiton, where those cars kept edging out and you were like, do you know, do you know who I am? This is my priority, and you, my priority. Just, you just whipped through it anyway. Yeah, awesome.
Although I've got still my gold Duke of Edinburgh, some sort of. Oh, that's fun. Regretting. Why? Duke of Edinburgh is fun. Oh, camping. Don't like camping. No, it sucks. In the summer, with all your mates, getting drunk in the field. Not on Duke of Edinburgh I'm not camping at all. No. <laughs> Secret vodka and like no. a coke um, No. Okay. Can't say that on YouTube. Don't give people bad ideas. Don't yeah. do that. Don't do that. Take my driving advice, but nothing else. Turn left, then go right on the roundabout and take the fourth exit. Okay, stop on the left. Don't worry about the driveways. Okay, Jess, that's the end of independent driving. I'm gonna direct you from here. Okay. So, drive on when you're ready. Waiting a long time to turn into this junction and missing some obvious gaps. I'd rather you be cautious, of course, because we're only risking a driver fault. But I know Jess is capable of setting off quickly and smoothly. Okay, Jess, that's the end of your driving test. How do you think you got on? I think it was fine. Okay. It was definitely less, like, big of a deal, like less intense than I thought it could have been. Yeah, it's just driving, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Just do your normal driving, like you do with your dad or yeah. your driving instructor, but for someone else who you don't know, yeah. they're gonna sit silent, so you yeah. can basically ignore them. 
yeah. follow a quite easy route around your hometown area yeah. that you live in <laughs> so you know the roads yeah. anything that was difficult on the drive um not being able to ask for help i found that fine okay, but cool. i think that maybe made me a bit more hesitant okay with like because i wasn't there to say yeah yeah yeah, God, yeah. okay to be honest your driving is amazing you've done so your dad does he want a job what does your dad do <laughs> well, give him my number get him to call me i've got a job for him when he wants one <laughs> so your dad's done a really good job your mum's obviously a really good teacher as well or you are just a really good student and naturally gifted at driving so i gave you four driver faults mm -hmm. yeah three of them were for stopping too close to other cars in traffic that's okay, something that yeah. you probably got from yeah. your dad have you heard of tires on tarmac yeah that's actually my driving instructor told me to go closer oh to really the... were you taking massive gaps then yeah i was taking and now you've gone gaps. completely the other way and stopped bumper to bumper just think about okay, the so... reasoning so if you get shunted from behind in traffic yeah you're that close you would then go person, into the front yeah. car in front undue hesitation i gave you that just on that junction yeah because there was a gap for you to go over like yeah. you said that might be something to work on yeah mm -hmm. if you're used yeah. to getting help with everything it could be difficult yeah. on your test so just keep on driving independently of that cool. awesome uh the other thing <sighs> you failed four was the maneuver oh really mm, yeah so when you're reversing tell me where you're supposed to look before you go backwards around the car so the left and right blind spots mm. did you realize where you looked don't you only look at the, on the left blind left. spot you move to the left mirror forwards probably check the back mirror and then you stopped at the right so i didn't look mirror. at the right blind you spot you didn't look in the right blind spot and then the oh, whole time you gosh. were reversing you didn't look over your right shoulder as well and yeah, we were reversing along a residential road with driveways someone, yeah. and pavements and yeah. houses so if somebody stepped out of their yeah. house you would only see them when they're in like your danger area you're about to hit them mm -hmm. soz. but this is good you learn stuff yeah right so you can take I this away yeah, i haven't really practiced that maneuver improve your maneuvers so, okay. it's all right yeah it's all right. It's That's, fine. i know that now the driving yeah. beautiful cool don't change anything except maybe giving cars a bit more space at traffic yeah. lights mm -hmm. it was such a good drive honestly cool. oh my god like yeah putting us driving instructors out of business <laughs> With dads like Jess's, <laughs> what do you need me for? If you're learning to drive, yeah. don't call TDS, call <laughs> Jess's dad. <laughs> Wicked. Yeah. Thank you so much for joining us and giving Thank us you. a rainy drive around Tolworth. Yep. Guys, comment below. How do you think Jess's drive was? Any hints, tips, well wishes, put it in the comments box. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.